Welcome back. Ashton back in action here at the Women's Series and what has been a disappointing day for the four-time world champion so far. Lisa Ashton went out at this second round stage in the opening event of the weekend, albeit against a double Outside. world champion in Makuru Suzuki. And that opened up a passage for Trina Gulliver to go and take her first Women's Series title. Well, a match now that, with all respect to her opponent, Ashton would expect to win. She takes on Steamer, Tara Dima. Can she spring a surprise and send Ashton out early again? Or will some order be restored? I'm Chris Murphy. Johnny Bryan alongside me all weekend. If you come back tomorrow, that is. <laughs> Indeed, I will be back. You have to prize me away. Yes, this is for the darts, guess, not for my company. <laughs> Indeed. Enfield against Bolton in this second round. 45. As you mentioned, Tara the Steamer Dima against the Lancashire Rose, Lisa Ashton. And Ashton, who had, had an unlucky draw 60. in the competition early on today, going up against Suzuki and falling at that particular hurdle. But the great thing about these events that there's also 41. another tournament just around the corner. Yeah. You do go out in the, one of the earlier competitions, so even that is the case, there's two more tomorrow. 40. No, it's not a bad return, is it, for Lisa Ashton winning three from five so far. Adam Sherrick and today Gulliver winning the others. Do you have one player already through to the last 16? That's Samantha Curtin. She's beaten Priscilla Steenbergen 4 1. 60. We'll run you through some results in the next leg. As Lisa Ashton may be closing in on this one already, down to a finish after a dozen. Yeah, no doubt we'll see what Trina Gulliver did earlier today. Taking that contest, what, just over an hour or so ago. 60. So 161 coming in for Ashton. Put it on 240, so it doesn't need to take it out in these three. Look to set it up with the next 90. three to come and a good cover onto the bullseye to leave 71. Dima on 240, we'll need a ton 40 to really pressurise the Lancashire Rose. He's not 60. going to, so it's going to be six darts from 71 for Lisa Ashton for the opening leg. Treble 13 or treble 17. Chooses a latter 14 now for tops, just in the single. 31. Just outside the double, but she will be back. Demet looking for a treble with this visit. <laughs> yeah, treble 20 was the target. A bit of a, a slip there, but she puts it right. 77. 10.03, but Ashton on tops, two tens. Two fives, chasing doubles. 35. And the door just slightly ajar here for Tara Dima. Especially if she can find a double here. Going downstairs, first of all, 19, 84 left. Trouble 20. Not there. 83, trouble 17 was the route, the orthodox route, I should say. But instead, taking the trouble 19, gets it down to a double of 26. And double two, though, for Ashton. Can try and bounce it in off that, and yes. she does. To take the first leg against the darts. A slow, st well, a slow finish to the leg, really. I was going to say a slow start, but Lisa Ashton had plenty in hand for most of the leg. Just took her time getting over the line. But over the line, nonetheless, two trouble 19s on the first visit for the 1-3-4 to put her opponent under pressure from the off. Yeah, as promised, just some notable results from this second round stage. Now, when I looked at the draw, the top half 80. was quite light, really, and the big threat to Fallon Sherrick in it was Rihanna O'Sullivan. She's been beaten. She was beaten in the second round by Priscilla Steenberg and 4-1. Steenberg has since gone out to Samantha Curtin. Corinne Hammond probably the main rival for Sherrick in that half of the draw now. A 4-2 win for her against Wen Wendy Reinstatler. Win two for Barbara Hospodarska, 4-2 over 
Kerry O'Connor and for Lorraine Wynne Stanley. She's bitten Katie Sheldon 4 2. Interesting story that because Wynne Stanley is a bit of a mentor for Sheldon. But the master has beaten the apprentice, and we will see Wynne Stanley on this streaming board in the third round when she will take on either Maria O'Brien or Tina Nalon. Oh, Sweet. wonderful stuff from Tara Dima. Yeah, superb from Tara to get herself Come back on. in the leg. And is within touching distance here to put pressure on the Lancashire Rose, especially if she can find a trouble with this visit. 41. Oh, the second out was just perfect line to have one land on right on top into the trouble 20. But 1 3 4 from Ashton coming in. Yeah, get a bit of time on her side, but she'll be a little bit wary of what went wrong in the previous leg. Particularly if Dima can sandwich a dart in that treble and couldn't manage it. So for 2-0, 39. I said to the board here, 7, double 16. Going to go left this time around to open up the bed. 15. And just landing in the bed of the eight. Leave 24. One, three, five from Dima. Bullseye should be the shot here. Yeah. It's not happening. So Ashton will come back with three at double 12, having hit the eight, going for that double 16. That time the dart on the wire, more of a hindrance than a help. 35. So she had to go for the air shot. But it's a clear bed to open up some daylight in this match. Three o'clock, two sixes. Six o'clock, two threes. 18. A bit of double trouble for Lisa Ashton. It wasn't a convincing end to the opening leg. And she will be back. But on Six. the double that nobody likes, double three. Mm, options here, straight at it or split it. Straight at it is indeed the same shot. Forte and it reaps the rewards. Lisa Ashton gets down in the end, doubles her lead, two zip, race to four. Medima's managed to get there or thereabouts in both legs, but only because Ashton has kind of fallen over the line in them. 41. Ashton looking to win a fourth women's series from six events this year, but we'll have to improve certainly a finishing if she's to do that. He will not be a double delight for the golden girl, Trina Gulliver. She has been beaten in the second round in this event. 4-1, she goes down to Scotland's Lorraine Hyde. But I'm sure 24. she will be more than happy with her day's work. Oh, absolutely. No doubt leave the arena now and have a, an early sad. night back to try and win another one tomorrow. Yeah, and she really has bolstered her bid to make it to the Women's World Match Play. As I mentioned, now third on the provisional order of merit, although Lorraine Wynne Stanley's victory actually in the second round has just changed that slightly. Leapfrogging Trina back into third spot where she it's started the day. We'll really focus more on that towards the end of tomorrow because we'll be past the halfway stage then it will be the halfway Five. stage at the end of this tournament in that race but it's going to be a great opportunity for eight of the top women players in world darts to showcase their talents on one of the biggest and best Thank stages you. in the sport good opening dart and a second how's the third 133. 133. Cleveland Ashton on 166. Her opponent way back on 317, but making inroads. One hundred. Yeah, I'm sure Lisa will be just going home at the end of the day. Like a day job, isn't it? Just yeah. down the road in Bolton. 94. I'll tell you what, if she does, and she will, I'm sure she will make it to Blackpool. She's as good as there. She'll get plenty of support. 
24th of July when that women's world match play takes place. I know that because it's my mum's birthday. <laughs> Hi, mum. Yeah, one of the, the great six. venues in World Darts, the Winter Gardens. 16, another one of them for tops. 52. Big ask. We just feel that Lisa 31. needs to hit this in this visit. It's been such a struggle on the outer ring. And she Eight beds shot. it first dart. Now that just will offer a little bit more encouragement, a little bit more optimism to take into the next round where she is destined to go. Yeah, three up with four to play with the darts in the fourth, but shake of the head from Ashton. And again, 77. Yeah, I thought she was thinking, oh, I've put the doubling right. Now the scoring's gone wrong. And she rescued it well with that last dart. Yeah, the 77 indeed. Demon, who's given Lisa the game, there's no doubt. It's just 41. Some of the uh, scoring visits just let down to Demon. Ashton. 77. Especially on the first nine here. Because I think it's on average about 20 points better, so that's been the difference in this game. 24. Confirmation that it will be Maria O'Brien who plays Lorraine Win Stanley on this stream next. It will be within a couple of minutes of this match ending. 100. Could be less than a couple of minutes until this match does end. Ashton closing in. Indeed, but Dima not going quietly into the night. Seventy nine. Seventy nine still hundred and ten adrift of Lisa Ashton who's looking to finish off a very professional performance. Ninety six. Yeah, not vintage, but hasn't needed to be. Steamer despite the scoreline, certainly hasn't been steamrolled in this one. 43. Ashton on 151. And he's got plenty of time to do this. 60. Take it down to 91. Lay up onto a score she'll feel comfortable with. Dima still needs another one of them to get anywhere close to a finish. Not going to be on this 79. occasion. So 91 here. Plenty of options. Knowing the uh, opponent's on 2, 3, 5. Hence the trouble 17. Trouble 14 now for double 16. Lay it up with a 20. 21. Tops when she returns. And she will return. Dima a long way behind. And that doesn't get her much closer. Seven scored. Seven is not the score you want a darts referee to be calling out. Leave that to Len Goodman. Ashton Big chasing Donovan. doubles, gets it at the third time of asking. And a very professional performance from Lisa Ashton, who beats Tara Dima by four legs to nil.